Nice convenient place to park. That's great. Or land. Great flying, Fox! For a moment I thought you weren't gonna make it! Very funny, sir. I know! Now, on to business! By pressing the start button, you will open your communicator. Choose who you wish to speak to, and then press the A button to contact one of us. Each team member will give you different information. It's not being tested in action, so give it a try as soon as I've finished. And don't forget, you're looking for the Queen Earthwalker. Try talking to those Thorntail guys. Slippy is preparing a translator device, but until it's ready, he'll translate for you. Okay, General. But what about a weapon? Why couldn't I bring my blaster? It's always the same with you, Fox. Shoot first, ask questions later. This mission is about saving the planet, not blowing it up. It requires a different tactic. Try using your head. <laughs> oh, we yeah, talking yeah. that shit right there, General Pepper. Fox out. So pretty much kind of pointless talk to the dinosaurs. They don't really pro provide that much lore. The skills in Alicia, they have taken the Queen of the Earth. See, this is kind of the same stuff we read before with how they have the things and all that. So Peppy is pretty much the map guy. So, yeah, pretty much all the locations you go on the world map, and then these are if you have maps bought from the shop. I hope my information is helping you, Fox. Peppy, signing off. And then Slippy's pretty much just a hinter guy. Fox, it's Slippy. Seems like you need some help. It's a static noise. What the heck? That was weird. Oh shit! It might be my. My beard tied in the mic. But yeah, he pretty much says you need to find a weapon or some sort of look out for something sticking out of the ground. Come back when you need me. Slippy, over and out. Slippy was a G when I needed him in the first playthrough. And then this guy's pretty much just what you've General got. Pepper so here. we have one so oh, spirit done. Some random crab items. To find out what those four things mean. And then the health can go up by four more. Don't let us down, Fox. I know you can do it. Thanks, man. So pretty much the weapons right here. And another cutscene. Uh, so yeah, pretty much, now we got a weapon, and now we can hit some people. See? And roll hit, and pretty much with those gems that we'll find out in just a second. He picked up a staff energy gem. They come in many different values and are used to power up the staff upgrades. Once you down, walk over them to pick them up. Okay, found future. Uh, first thing we're gonna do, I guess for later on, we don't have to worry about it, is open that gate that's on the other side. Actually, no, first I'm gonna get these. So we don't have to focus on them after. Ooh, look at the moon come out. This is a fuel cell, it is used to power the air R wing. Rob had a few problems getting them down to the surface of Dinosaur Pad, which means they have been scattered around everywhere. You will need them to enable you to fly to the floating worlds in orbit above the planet. So, they're pretty easy to find, there's a lot of them, so it's not that bad. I should have rolled right there. This game has got the real time physics and friggin' time, man. Go milk yourself, I don't know about this. So yeah, there's no jump button, you pretty much just gotta run past the gaps. Let's get some health here. Yep. Um, pretty much what I'm doing is going to that little switch right there that opens up the gate down there to an area that we gotta get to later on. Just so we don't have to worry about it now. Oh, I thought rolling would save me. Whatever. 
Was it raining? No, it's not. Uh, under these rocks are scarabs that you use for um, the shop. Uh, you, you could see the frustration here. You gotta deal with this every time. This is a scarab. They are the currency of Nacho Planet and come in many different values. The more valuable scarab, the harder it is to catch. Until you find a scarab bag, you can only carry 10 scarabs. What a shame. Okay. Let's... Oh, okay, this is a bomb plant. Find a way to make it explode and it will throw out bomb spores. Collect these spores as they will become very useful when you need to get through solid walls. Though when you plant a spore, it will not throw out any new spores. Nah, man. Yeah, what's happening now? So the fighting in this game is really easy. It's pretty much you just go against one guy while the other three just stand around. I mean, I don't know if the GameCube couldn't handle it, like having multiple people you fight at the same time while you're hopping around. Would have been so much better if you had your blaster going to that's in, in another hand. And you're just like, blah, 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 and with the blast from him and stuff. But yeah, it's kind of sad. So it's never really hard, the gameplay is able to just stand up there and take a hit. Ooh, fancy. And now we go there. Swimming is also automatic. There are no diving options. Which is kind of sucks, but well, not a big deal. Oh, I don't even want to go there. And see how it's glowing. Controller's vibrating like crazy. The ones that have water surrounding them give you a new power. The ones that are just flat make your power meter longer. Like that staff meter. So right now I'm getting a new power. Dun, 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 dun. You've collected your first staff upgrade, the Fire Blaster. With the power from the energy crystals, it can be used for many tasks. Move C to activate the menu and highlight the upgrade, then you press A to use it. If you need to use it quickly, assign it to Y for instant access. I pretty much put this at instant access, unless I need to use another power for a, like a boss or an area, but usually like 90% of the time I have this. Oh, and there you go. Um, let's keep going. We gotta hit that big sign. I hate these things. Look away. What you looking at? I'm fine, man. Eh? You don't want to talk? I think you can hit them too and they don't do anything, so... It's Nice way to show a child how to beat beat animals for fun. Is anybody there? Are you okay? My name is Fox McCloud, and you must be the Queen Earthwalker. No Lurud no Karu Ve Uwe Moshe Fox like what the hell? Roots of K Hot Rokio Sharp Claws. Ut ice mountain. Did you get that, Slippy? You've got to go to the ice mountain and rescue her son, the Prince Tricky. Hello, oh, Rick Creeper smile. Okay, lady, I'll bring your son back to you. Uh, can you give me some directions? Mish wiki kill warp stone. 
Kutsu Kutsu Shbuk Feno Utsu Jod Uwe Keo You've got to talk to that big stone guy. She called him a warp stone. That's all I need to know. I'll be back soon, Queen. Don't you worry. Haven't you finished that translator yet? It's nearly ready, Fox. I just need a bit more time. Slippy out. Damn it, Slippy. Get your shit in gear. I need you. So, obviously, now we need the bombs to blow that up. So, let us shoot that bomb. Whoa. Gotta press down. Man, the sensitivity on aiming is so awkward. Again, we're only going to be able to get one because of the... This thing. <laughs> this is a bomb sword. It's full of explosives goodness. Find somewhere planted and see what grows. And there goes the other. So let's get... Let's just stock up on these. I think you can get seven. But it's really hard to get all three. Well, sometimes you can. And one more time. Alright, that's the max we can get seven, but let's first go to the store, because we need to... Damn it, I wanted to jump off. So I didn't know you can bargain with the person. I always thought it was just that final price. Oh, I think it's in this place. The stone? The rock candy? No. I think buying any of these is really a waste of money unless you're getting those blue mushrooms, which we'll find out later while we need them. So in here. You need to give the warpstone rock candy because he always says nobody brings them gifts anymore. You pay this much. Nah, I'll buy for seven. No, that's too Oh, come on, bruh. Get out! <laughs> Yo, he hates me. You pay this much. No, that's too low. Okay, I'll see. Oh my god, such a creepy looking person. This is rock candy. It is a very tasty sweet rock that would make a sweet make a great gift. This is the thing that was supposed to be given to me, but it was dropped. Put that down. You don't have enough scabs. It's true that I'm broke. Here's a little secret area you can go to if you want some red red ones. Right in there, big rock. You can get three of them, I think that's 30, I think? Yeah, but I can only hold 10. So, kinda sad. Let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Come on, Fox, climb that damn thing. I'm gonna put one bomb right here. Okay, this is a bomb spore planting patch. Plant a spore here and see what happens. Ooh, it's blazing. Why can't there be a back step? No, no. Turn around, turn around. Nice. Now what could be in here? 
Ooh, nice. So that's six of them. Alright, let's make our way up here and put the bomb here and scare the shit out of this poor dinosaur that's not gonna know where to hit him. I still understand why I only move that much, like, oh my god, and he's still asleep. Like, come on, bruh. How turn were you last night? What's up, what's up? This isn't really a good time to talk, but if you see any egg snackers, be sure to get them. Why don't you go and talk to the warp stone? Okay. Nobody ever brings me gifts anymore! Like Scottish or Irish. Ah, a lovely sweetie. Man, he's so Scottish. A thousand years I've been left alone to rest. <laughs> what do you want? Uh, well, can you help us? <laughs> help you? No. <laughs> he's so but mean. you're a warp stone. You're supposed to help. Yeah, yeah, drunk. Uh, right. Let's see if I can remember what I'm supposed to do. To do. Okay. Now if you push left on the control stick, then I'll send you to one of those warp stone thingies. We'll get back to that in a minute. And if you push forward on the control stick, then you can enter the maze. Ugh. Ah, now this one's a bit special. When you have collected a Crozoa spirit, then push right on the control stick. And I'll send you to Crozoa Palace. <gasps> now, you know what I do. So hurry up and make a choice. If not, then press B so I can yeah, get back, back to sleep. Light. Okay, so pretty much if you press up, you go to the well maze, which is pretty much just to do um uh, cheats, but they never worked. Man, I bought cheat tokens like crazy. You buy them from those little wells, you'll see. Like the one in the shop, you give him 20 scrubs and he gives you a token, but he, uh, the cheat tokens don't do anything. At least they didn't do anything for me. I like how he never got back to talking about Are ice you me. ready to walk? Yeah, bro. Are you ready? Star Fox tripping out. Don't do acid, kids. Don't do acid. I wonder what Star Fox got in that little kitty backpack of his. Whoa, I didn't know that was gonna happen. bad watching the snow. Oh my god, they can put this in a game? Animal cruelty? Oh, this is terrible. Huh? We gotta save him, Fox! Save that poor little dinosaur from getting his ass whipped. He can't be ass. Okay, first, oh, the shit beeps, so you can't hold it for a long time. Beat the shit out of these guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, get ran. And voila, pops up right up there. Great. We're gonna want this thing here. I think it's just a cheat token buying place, but we'll see. Oh my god, sensitivity on that though is ridiculous. 
Not as bad as you, actually. I like him garbage. Throw me 20 scarabs, and I'll give you a cheap token. No. Alright, let's get that shit open. He's mal. Hey, scale face. Pick on someone your own size. Niak. Nitchkiak. I am Fox McCloud, lead pilot of the Star Fox team. I've come to take the prince back to his home. Hey, wait. Oh, man, he got blindsided right there. Damn, come on, Fox. Some bears and shit right there. Now we gotta catch up. You either pretty much gotta beat these guys in the race or take them all out and then beat them. But it's better to. Sh I'll show you the way I do it. Oh, not like that. Definitely not like that. Whoa, what are you doing? Oh my god, that gameplay's terrible. Oh, I'm not used to this. Holy shit. Oh man. Oh, the sensitivity is so weird on this thing. Damn it, you got my wave, dude. You screwed me over. No, I'm gonna fail. I used to accelerate, right? Am I accelerating even right now? It doesn't even feel like it. What the heck? Oh my god, it's so bad. Sense to be so awkward. Nah, we lost. Damn! At least it doesn't replay the cutscene. Come on, this is embarrassing. Oh, that rock always screws me up. And this is how you get him right here. They're gonna try to come in this tunnel and just slowly ass down. And cheesy. See now we can just calmly make our way. That dumbass dinosaur that can probably run like Usain Bolt, because I don't know how else you can get this far. This music's kinda awkward now. I didn't really get hyped about. Damn, it's going so slow? And they're still behind us somehow. Fudu, a Uet Rovekwat Rodan. I can't understand you. 